Hello, my name is Ben and I'm eight years old and I really love dinosaurs and I've loved them since as long as I can remember. I'm making this video to show you my, my passion of dinosaurs. Um, so I'm sending these videos to paleontologists out there and I want to ask them how to, how to become a paleontologist. And I also really want to go on a dig for dinosaur bones and maybe get something like, you know, a T-Rex teeth or something like that. So here I'm, I'm about to show you all of my favourite books and why I like them. So let's start off with this World Encyclopedia of Dinosaurs and Prehistoric Creatures. As you can see, it's very ripped, so I decided to take it together because I love it so much. <laughs> uh, my granddad had to fix it with a really strong sellotape and it's got really good images and I really, really like this book. It's by a man called Dougal Dixon. He's a really good author. And then this one about dinosaur art. It's got loads and loads of good pictures, like this one here, and these, and all of these. This one is my favourite of the Mosasaur jumping out the sea, and this is the asteroid over here, and I found that really interesting. So there's also this one by Dr. Thomas Holtz, my favourite paleontologist. Um, I really, 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 really um, like this book because it's really, um, it's got loads of facts and sometimes funny as well. My favourite paleontologists um, apart from um, Dr. Thomas Holtz, my favourite, was Philip Curry. He was um, digging in Argentina when he found these really big footprints of an Albertosaurus that are about that big. They're massive, huge, and there are about 23 Albertosauruses hunting in one big pack. So then he was interested in giant pack hunting dinosaurs, and then I big began into that and then I was interested in that as well. Another um, paleontologist that I really liked was Roy Chapman Andrews, the guy who discovered Velociraptor. See? He discovered the first dinosaur nest and Velociraptor. Um, and I also like him because I like the movie Indiana Jones and he, and as if you've ever seen Indiana Jones, he, he's got the whip, the hat, the gun and he's got the fear of snakes. And so is Roy Chapman Andrews. The hat, the whip, the gun, and the fear of snakes. So those are my two favorite paleontologists. I've been learning about dinosaurs over the years since I was zero. And I have, I know about 240 different dinosaur species, although there are 3,000 of them. And I've also got some favourite dinosaurs. Um, my favourite is called Monolophosaurus. It's got it's a meat eater that has a crest that, and it's connected to its nasal cavity, which it, it which allows it to scare off a rival like this. You know. Um, another skill that I'm really proud of is that I can identify any dinosaur by their skull. So I'm really proud of that. So these are all of my dinosaur toys. Um, as you can see, there's a T-Rex here, the mighty ferocious beast of the Cretaceous. And there's also the Brachiosaurus here. And he looks like the one from Jurassic Park. I've also got a fancy triceratops that my granddad gave me, or as we like to call him, Papa. So now as you can see, we've got some fossils here. This is an ammonite that I found at Lyme Regis. Um, and there's, there's one here, if you can see. There's also one faint one over there. And Lyme Regis was once a Jurassic Ocean as well. So, and these are also some other ammonites that I found in the same place, Lyme Regis. 
Um, there's one there if you can see it, there's one there and there's one there. But last and definitely, definitely, absolutely, definitely not least, my Megalodon tooth. It's pretty big, huh? Yep. And that's only from a baby. The adults, however, can grow up to this big. That's big. I would like to introduce you to my little sister, Sophia. Hi. So, Sophia, what is your favourite dinosaur? Um, I have two favourites, and it's T-Rex and Diplodocus. Okay, and I see you've got some drawings here. Would you like to show yes. everybody? So, when I was little, I did this little drawing of a Velociraptor. As he has a moustache there. <laughs> Um, and this was a picture for Ben of, of, of a T-Rex. Let's see that he's a blind bird. Hello, my name's called Sophia. And I'm going to tell you all about my brother Ben, how much he likes Steinson. He does a club of them and I'm always a helper in his clubs and yeah. He's like, he just pictures every day and all the time of dinosaurs. As you can see, these are all of my dinosaur drawings and paintings. Quite a lot. Um, so this is one of the handbooks I made. It's called The Great, Dis the Great Dinosaur Discoveries of Liang in China. And also, this is my mic favourite, favourite, favourite drawings of a crazy velociraptor. Therisnosaurus, here. As you can see, he's got big claws. Also, some Deinonychus, a pack of Deinonychus atta attacking a Tenontosaurus. Scary, vicious. Another good one was, it's not a dinosaur, but I really like it anyway. It's a frilled lizard. It's got tiny little scales on it. I spent hours and days doing that. I've done this particular drawing that I really like of an Eosynopteryx. And Eosynopteryx was discovered in 2013, really recently. Another one is this big drawing. I did of an Allosaurus going to attack a Stegosaurus. This is on cardboard. Two Carcrodontosauruses attacking a Paralititan. Another skill that I'm really proud of is drawing a, um, any dinosaur in 20 seconds. So my dad, over here, the cameraman, is going to um, give me a name of a dinosaur. Go on. Um, Pachycephalosaurus. Okay, start the clock. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen, seventeen, eighteen, nineteen, twenty. Do you like it? That's ace. That's really cool. Thank you. I also like places where I can see real life dinosaur bones. And a, a really cool thing that I did at the Natural History Museum is go into the paleontology department. And here is a picture of me mm. in it with really short hair. And as you can see, this is an ichthyosaur fossil, and that's one of my friends that I met there holding a bug. And so, yeah, another place I really like to go is the um, Crystal Palace Park, if you've ever been there, which is this big, really cool park where there's these dinosaurs, dinosaur models there, and there's lots of plesiosauruses. Megalosaurus, Iguanodons, Hylaeosauruses, and all that. 
And I also, another place that I want to go to is called, is the American Museum of Natural History Museum, um, of Natural History in um, New York. And apparently it's got really, really, really good foss fossils, really good, um, you know, dinosaur skeletons and models and robots of them. So yeah, I'd really like to go there as well. Please leave a comment below or go or email me at jurassicbocked at gmail.com. If you're and if you're a paleontologist, I'd I'd love you to get in touch.